Good afternoon everybody. Welcome back to our channel. Just wanted to do a quick build today of the Grave Warrior. We were able to get him after Halloween at Home Depot for half off. Um, I did get him through the website. So one thing I will say is when you do that, sometimes you get them in an unmarked box. I do wish I had the in-store box only because we do collect them. And it's just an easy, quick way to identify them. So I will be keeping the original uh, postage box, which also has the directions on it. But um, but I was real excited. I just wanted to put them together, check them out. Um, I didn't want to wait eight, ten months to do that. So uh, just real quick. With the stand here, again, it's like some of the other ones where you have a, a larger section in the front and then the wire welding a little closer to the back. And when you do have that, usually that wider space in the front is actually for the front of the prop. So, um, thing we're gonna do is put in first body posts here, start building this guy up. Both the feet are labeled C, so it doesn't matter which side they go on. And one of the other things I did when I unbox this guy is move the stickers to a space where you don't really see them, but just in case I would lose the directions, um, it's just one of those things that can be helpful at times. To build up his part here, and then we're gonna go back and attach the support poles that came. I should have done that a little sooner. A little spot inside. Just to give him a little extra stability. Here would be to put his pants on. There's a little Velcro on here that you can just attach down on. This gives a neat appearance. Body on here. And then we can bring his pants up. All right. Thing we've got is his arms here. Start them. And then we're gonna put on his shirt. So Velcro to the back. You want to make sure you do this just right. You just want to make sure you have your Velcro points in place for a, a step in the future. So one in the front, one right on his shoulder, and one just behind his arm. So when we go to put the top pads on, you'll see why that's important. Inside your outfit, there's a Velcro pad. It's gonna attach that here just to keep his outfit in place. And now for the other arm.
Same thing, has Velcro in there. the G off of here. Doubt anybody wants to see that on their prop. Right, so the next we do have the rest of his weapon. One side is finished, so it tells you this side's gonna go in here. There's a spot for a larger tab and a smaller. So just wanna make sure you line those up right and then just twist on. Same on here. Quick live access. Make a couple of these other connections. Match up your colored wires here. Last wires for the sensor, so he'll be going on shortly. Okay. Small hole in the front of the suit, Velcro and myself. match up there's velcro behind here just want to match those up right on the velcro on his outfit that had the sensor attachment so we can attach the last wire so he's fully wired up so this means he can get closed up here Some moral support from our dog Bella here. All right, so now when we we're talking about keeping your Velcro at a certain spot. There is three points of Velcro inside this plastic piece here. So one will go to that, one will rest on the shoulder, and one. want to watch these two because the velcro does tend to want to come off we've already had to reattach them once so same thing on this side so the cape will be his last part here Okay. 
Well, you can adjust it as needed. But, uh, all right, guys, there he is. Let's get him started up and uh, let me know what you think here. Did I hear a snide insult from you? I prefer my sharp axe to your cutting remarks. Perhaps you are keen to test weapon against weapon. <laughs> I didn't think so. I hear your mommy calling. You better scatter off. All right, guys, I think this will be a good addition to the castle theme we're going to expand on this year. So this guy is going to be... This is a grave warrior, but obviously he's a warrior protecting the castle, so we'll see how that goes come this coming the fall. Best part of but, uh, let us know what you think, I and thanks right for tuning in. in. I don't even need